Hey, Marlon, thanks for taking the time today. Oh, okay. yeah, thank you, guys. With Jimmy Kemsky and then Paul Tomowicz. Hey, Marlon, uh, welcome to Philly. Um, there were some draft analysts who thought that you were going to take in you know, a few rounds earlier even than you did. Um, I'm assuming that you don't think that there are 188 players in that draft uh, better than you, and is there extra motivation that you had to wait a little while longer to hear your name called? I mean, uh, like with me now, I'm just glad to be here with Philly, you know, uh, like whatever happened, happened, and I'm I'm over it already. I'm just glad to be here in Philly and excited to get to work. We'll go to Paul and then Jeff Skversky. Hey, Marlon. I uh, wanted to ask you about something you talked about on draft night, which is your wrestling background. Um, I mean, so many defensive tackles uh, are ex-wrestlers, and it clearly helps with your leverage, your hand use, uh, staying on your feet. Talk about all of that and how it how it's helped you in football. Right. I mean, yeah, the only reason I did wrestling back in high school was to help me become a better football player. And yeah, like just understanding the body and how to maneuver it in certain positions to to your advantage. And then it helps with having violent hands and then uh, good feet, like being able to stay balanced even in un uncomfortable situations. So like things like that definitely helped me become a better football player. Thanks. Jeff and then Martin. Jeff, I think you're on mute. Sorry, my first time on Zoom. <laughs> Obviously, you've dreamed of this, getting to this point. To strap on that helmet this weekend, to go out on that field, what is the excitement level for you and the sense you get from the other rookies and draft picks? And, and what are your impressions of Nick Sirianni? Um, you know, he seems like an excited guy. He's going to get his first chance to see you guys on the field this weekend. Thank you. Right. Yeah, um, excited to be here. Like that's, I feel like that's the vibe of I'm getting from all the rookies. Like we've already uh, created uh, connections with each other, so that's that's been great. Um, I think we're all excited to, you know, just be here to uh, like live out our our lifelong dreams. Like, and uh, we're just here to to learn and from these coaches, meet these coaches, and learn from them, and to help us become better football players. And can I just follow up on your impressions of Nick? so far and his excitement level to see you guys out on the field and work with you guys even in the classroom oh yeah like we've already met with uh coach Sirianni a couple of times and and it, and his his energy like that's something that stands out to me and um, I'm excited to learn from him and, and 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 the rest of the coaching staff for sure Martin and then Zach hey Marlon um you're obviously part of a pretty large rookie class and you know last year they had 10 draft picks and they'll probably have like you know, about 10 next year as well. Do you feel like you and, like, a lot of the younger guys, I mean, eventually, like, this is, like, the opportunity for, for the Eagles to kind of become your team going forward, like, you know, a couple of years down the road and everything? Do you look at it that way? I mean, for me, I'm just living it day by day, like, just trying to let things sink in. I mean, like, again, like, this has been a dream of mine since I was a little kid. So f to finally – uh make it become a reality. I'm, I'm just excited to be here and, and continue to learn and, and uh, have these coaches and uh, people around me just help me become a better football player and a better person. Zach and then Bo. Hey, Marlon, because of your background as a nose tackle, I don't know if you get typecast or you get described more as, as like a run-stuffing type player. How are you as a pass rusher, and what do you want to do to, to develop that area of your game going forward? Um, yeah, of, like, uh, that's something I definitely want to get better at. Like, over my overall game, I definitely want to get better at. But um, rushing the pass I feel like that's something I can uh, develop here in Philly, having guys like Javon uh, Hargrave and Fletcher Cox and uh, even the edge guys as well. Like, they're all great pass rushers, and that's something I can, I'm excited to do once they get here and, and learn from them. If I can follow up, I – at USC, were you uh, penetrating a lot or, or was it mainly occupying blockers? A little bit of both, you know, just trying to uh, hold the hold the, hold the the point and then also being disrupted at the same time, uh, trying to make my plays whenever they were, they, they come to me, try to make my plays and, and things like that, like just trying to stay inside of the defense and what they wanted from us as a, as a player. Thank you. Go ahead, Bo, and then Ed Kratz. 
Hey, Marlon, as you, as you have gotten to know, uh, you know, the rest of the rookies over the last couple of days, who has, you know, uh, made an impression on you? Is there anybody who's sort of like, you know, the most talkative guy or anything like that uh, when you guys are all together? I mean, like uh, right now I'm, I'm mainly with the D line. So just getting to know, uh, Milton, uh, Milton, Tehran and, and Jaquan, uh, I'm excited, like being around those guys. Cause they're, they're all cool guys, you know, hard workers and, and funny guys as well. So just trying to, uh, create a connection off all four of us, uh, being rookies and stuff, just trying to create that connection with each other. Thank you. Go ahead, Ed. Hey, Marlon, I just, you know, your impression so far of, you know, Philadelphia and, uh, you know, the facility where you're going to be, uh, you know, training for, you know, a very long time, I guess, hopefully, uh, just your impressions, your first impressions of the, the, those two things. Uh, it's been great. You know, it's my, uh, first time out here in the East Coast, so coming here to Philly, like it's been great. So, like I'm excited to be here, like I keep saying, and 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 just gonna continue to keep working and, and things like that. All right. Are there any other questions for Marlon? No. All right. Thank you for your time, Marlon. Thank you.